You are a walking corpse. I shall never rest till Whisper is avenged. That was unbelievable. I haven't seen anything like it for a long time. I'll guide you back through the Hall of Heroes. You truly deserve to stand amongst them. I must say, you remind me of someone who fought here many years ago. Memory's not what it used to be, but I think her name was Scarlet Robe. That's right. Ever heard of her? Probably not. It was all before your time. But if you look on your right, you'll see her statue. She was the first female hero to become arena champion. She was a fine hero, just as soft-hearted as you. But her dedication came with a price. After her final battle, she was never the same. She lives now in complete solitude, crushed by her failure to save her family long ago. And yet here you are. I knew her son would end up here one day. It's in your blood. And in your sister's too. You should bring her to me. I so long to reunite you both with your mother. Just think of the happiness it would bring her. This was the true face of his mother. Scarlet Robe, Slayer of Balverines. Once one of the fiercest heroes in all of Albion. Yet her most splendid battle was also to be her last. Ambushed by a dozen Balverines, Scarlet killed them all, only to fall injured and drained beside their corpses. There she would have died but for Brom, a kind and simple woodsman who tended her back to health. In time they married and had two children, a girl and then a boy. Scarlet's days of death were forever behind her. Whatever you decide, you've earned the champion seal. People everywhere will recognize you as the winner of the arena, and it will grant you access to Bowerston North. Don't lose it. It is rather valuable. And we're done. And look at that money we got right there. Can you imagine if you repeat this multiple times how much you will get? That's why everybody abuses it. Hey you, Theresa wants you to meet her at the Grey House. And before we do that, let's go see what kind of upgrades we can get from the guild. Shut up. Quick is just to teleport back. Should be able to get quite a few things here. Okay. Man, that's a lot of experience. Alright. Let's get physique and check other stuff. I don't want to spend all my general in one spot quite until I've spent everything else. Upgrade that again. Put some more into speed. Speed's really the only skill-based uh, experience I need to spend it on. I'm not much of a thief. Let's see, we're all at level 6. Alright, toughness is almost done. I think that's its last stage there.
Just level that up for now. Alright. That's a big jump. Now let's see how high the, uh, the potions will push my health and mana bars. These don't really matter. You can drink these anywhere you want. Uh, doesn't matter what your... Oops. Doesn't matter what your combat multiplier is. It, it has no effect on these. I'm just trying to drink these all as fast as I can. And there we go. Okay. That's not too bad. Your sister is waiting to meet you at the Grey House, near Barrow Fields. Is there a quest for it? Mm, nope. And these are all still good quests. So we can just ignore all these for now. See if there's anything I can sell. Rubbish! Thank you. You're sure to find something to suit you. Oh good, he'll buy all my useless ranged weapons. Sell the chocolates. Red meat I'm going to keep, just because eating the red meat gives you strength-based experience. Uh, like 6 or 8 or 12, something like that. Not a lot, but it helps. No real weapon upgrades for me. Nope. And of course the guild's not going to carry crunchy chicks. I'll probably just save and quit for now. Okay. Uh, well now we've got Bowerstone North open, so let's travel over there real quick and see what we can get, uh, see what we can get into. What is with this lag? Hey, man. Hey! That's right, be afraid. Be very afraid. Now you could teleport over here, but eh, I like to walk sometimes. I don't know why. I'm, I'm sure I said that previously, but okay. Oh, there's a silver key up there. Cool. Let's go get that real quick. I've got my eye on you. I thought you... Gone? Still having some lag problems. That's weird. I'll hope that clears up. Okay. And Power Stone North is right up these stairs right here. Oh, hello there. Oh, yes. You're well known enough to come in. Thank you, I guess. Only famous people allowed. Welcome to Barstow North, hero. This is a quiet district, and we like to keep it that way. We don't tolerate uncivil behavior here, so mind you don't end up in our holding cell. We have a raving lunatic locked up right now, but he won't be seeing many more sunrises, if you know what I mean. Now, Lady Grey desires to speak with you. You'll find her grace in the gardens outside of Mention. This is a great honour, even for a hero, so mind your manners. And there's a shop right up here that sells a few May pretty I cool help, items. Are you just looking around? You've come to the right place. See if he'll buy any of my worthless junk still. Ooh, bright wheel users, he'll buy all that. I have no use for that set. Let's 
see if there's any weapons upgrades for me. Hmm, Master Katana, huh? Ooh. Buy that. I'll just sell my old one off. There we go. <laughs> doll of myself, doll of thunder. You can collect all the dolls. I forget what for right now, but if I remember correctly, there was something useful for them. Uh -huh. Apparently, it won't let me equip the weapon. No I'll wonder that you've been nominated later. for the arena. You did the impossible. Uh, I've already beaten the arena. Kind of a strange thing to say now. What gives? And over here is Lady Grey. Aren't you going to talk to me? So, you're the one everyone is talking about. I must say, you have me intrigued. Will you walk with me to the courtyard? I would so love to speak with you. It's lovely here, don't you think? But sometimes it feels like the loneliest place in the world. You see, I haven't married yet. Somehow I've never met a man worthy enough. I've always known that only someone who could conquer the arena could conquer me. Perhaps you could bring me a gift from town. I'm sure you can find something fitting for a lady. Well, let's go see if we can figure out what she would like. Normally you would think it'd be something like a rose or chocolates or maybe perfume, but uh, she's got odd tastes. Rubbish! I'm keeping you under surveillance. I suppose she's got you getting her gifts, has she? <laughs> yeah, I thought so. Well, anyway, if you want to impress her, you ought to buy her a black rose. She truly loves those flowers. <laughs> She's the only one who does. They're creepy, I think. Alright, and then there's the insane guy over here. We're all in terrible danger! Finally, someone to talk to. You've got to help me out. The mayor's having me executed. That's what happens when you start asking too many questions round here. That woman is a demon, but no one will believe me. Just because I was wrong about the guards controlling our dreams by spiking our water supplies. Her sister was an angel. Would have made a wonderful mayor. And I know Lady Grey killed her. I just know it. You have to help me prove it. Otherwise, Bowerstone will remain in her clutches and I'll be executed. I always choose to help this guy. Just because it's a fun little side quest. Yes, finally! We're going to bring that crazy witch down! All you need to do is get her dead sister to tell you what really happened. Don't give me that look. We all know ghosts exist. You've seen them. I've seen them. We've all seen them. Lady Grey's sister, Amanda, had a sweetheart called Rodri. Nice guy. Usually hangs out in barrow fields. If anyone knows how to entice her out of oblivion, it's him. Hmm. Barrow fields, huh? Crop circles. Let's head there and see what's going on. 